Hi guys, so for a really long time, you guys have been consistently asking for a skincare routine video. And for a really long time, I've been secretly hoping that this video request idea would be forgotten about and kind of just like fade away. And the reason behind that is because I'm a financial advisor. I know nothing about skincare and cosmetics and beauty. Like I have no education, no training, no knowledge whatsoever. And as far as I know, I could be doing the worst things to my skin. But I have decided to make this video and because I wanted to stay really, I guess, true and authentic to my YouTube videos and brand and I guess message, which is all about, you know, financial education and empowerment, inspiration and motivation. I am making this skincare routine, I guess I'm linking it in with the principles and I guess philosophy and messages and advice that I would apply in to anyone who is trying to build, um, I guess, financial independence and security for themselves. So it might be a bit of a weird video, but here goes. And I promise you, I will link all the products that I use in the description box below. So you know exactly what I'm using. And by all means, if you have any suggestions for my skin, please also feel free to put them in the comments box below. Okay, so here we go. Okay, so just like at the end of every day, we need to wash our faces. Well, we also need to wash our minds of any negative thoughts or beliefs or theories around money that are holding us back in life. We don't want our brains, our minds, our souls, our spirits being clogged with dirty, toxic, ridiculous and incorrect ideas around money. Any negative beliefs or thoughts or attitudes around money are just going to hold you back from achieving greatness. And just when you think you've washed away and done all that hard work on shifting all those negative attitudes and perceptions you may have previously had, it's always best to give it one more extra cleanse just to go that little bit deeper and be 100% certain that you are ready to build a foundation of healthy, positive, uplifting financial attitudes and theories around money. And most importantly, that you are actually entitled to a, a, entitled to a life of financial security and independence. Yes, I am splendid twice. Now, just as we would like to give ourselves a steam spa, which really opens up the pores and allows any sort of new products that we apply to work their wonders. You need to keep your mind always open to all the opportunities and inspiration that constantly surrounds us. This helps us keep mo focus and motivation to keep growing financially and commit to our financial goals. Exfoliation. A lot like getting out of debt. It takes a while, it's pretty slow, and it hurts a bit. But when you see how good you feel afterwards, like fresh and invigorated and re-inspired, you realize it's definitely worthwhile doing. Toner. Just like a toner prepares the skin for the moisturizer, you need to tone your energy and excitement and enthusiasm around the new financial future that you're gonna create for yourself. This will help you stay focused and motivated. Serum. You want to make sure your serum is intensive and specific, just like the financial goals that you want to achieve. It's kind of like making my skin a little bit Ooh, stinging. Moisturize. Pretty much my favorite part of the skincare routine. This is where the skin is just craving for moisture and nourishment after all the products and techniques being used on it. A lot like our financial goals, they're craving, out, craving for the right type of actions where you nourish your finances with, I guess, investing in cash, investing in passive income streams, or maybe just for your long-term retirement needs. But 
we all know that the more moisture you give your skin, the less you're going to age. So the more investing and I guess responsibility with your money, the less stress and aging on your body. Sun cream, essential protection. When it comes to building wealth, you also want to make sure you've got the right products and strategies in place to protect that wealth. And also to make sure that you can continue on achieving your current financial goals as well as your future financial goals once those ones have been achieved. So having the right type of protection products is essential. These are things like, I guess, income protection, life insurance, total and permanent disablement insurance, even critical illness or trauma cover. They're going to help make sure that you can achieve your goals no matter what happens to you from a medical perspective. Face mask. Just like every now and again, it's worth just taking a load off, applying a face mask so you can, your skin can really do that just time off and just absorbs the goodness of all your hard work and products. Reviewing your financial goals and strategy is also worthwhile doing. Analyzing what financial goals you set for yourself, which ones you achieved, why you achieved them, maybe they were too easy, or maybe you were super motivated and passionate about them. Also reviewing the financial goals that you didn't achieve. What went wrong? Why? What could you do better next time? This review process is so important. It helps you fine tune your efficiency around building wealth and financial security. Well, you will be pleased to know this is the end of my skincare routine video. I will be doing a makeup routine video because you guys have also requested that, but it will probably be a while before I get a chance to. Anyway, don't forget you can follow me on Sugar Mama TV on Instagram and like us on Facebook. I will see you next week on Lifestyle Love or Money Monday without all this on my skin. And we'll be going back to, I guess, financial inspiration and encouragement. I'll see you next week. Ciao.